Okay, so today I'm going to show you how to use a great little website called keepvid.com. Um, a lot of us like to use web clips for class and sometimes it's hard to stream things because the internet can get a little wonky or you just want to be able to have access to it anytime you need it. So this is a really helpful tool for you to be able to get a small video clip that you might need for class without having to use the internet once you've uploaded it. Um, right now you see me on YouTube. I've got a clip of a chorus that's playing and I want to use that for my music class to show students. So what I'm going to do is actually open up another window and I'm going to go www.keepvid.com and here's the website. Now if you look down at the bottom here um, it actually shows you all the different websites that are supported by this particular website. So you can actually get videos from NBC News, from YouTube, from Vine, Vimeo. Um, it actually has quite a few websites that it works with that would be really great for school, especially discovery.com and things like that. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to quickly go back to my other video and up here you see there's the link for the video. I'm just going to copy that and then I'm going to go over here and I'm going to paste it right in and I just click download okay and as soon as you do that you'll see this list come up and you're gonna pick if you want the video clip you're gonna pick mp4 if you simply want an audio clip then you would do download the mp3 okay in which case it will save the music for you but it won't have a video picture okay I'm gonna use the whole clip so I'm gonna click mp4 up here and then once you click on it you're going to notice down here it's actually going to start I clicked it too many times obviously that I have three different downloads um, it's going to actually start downloading the video okay I was going to try to cancel those extra two but so you'll see this down here and what will happen is once it's done you can actually open it okay I'm going to pause the video right now but now the video has actually been downloaded to my computer so what I want to do now is actually move this file to my desktop or to um, a flash drive. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into my folders and I'm going to go to downloads and there's the download right there. So you can simply just drag it to your desktop and then if you want to save it to a specific area or anything like that you now have the ability to drag it over to a new folder or anything else but now this is actually on my desktop without me having to use the internet See, so I can play that even if I'm not connected to the internet which makes it a whole lot easier um, that's pretty much keep it in a nutshell and if you have any questions feel free to come see me in the library